Trillo Nation, today's move. All right, so we're gonna be working from the guard. First one we're gonna work on here is hip bump. Okay, his hands are, he puts his hands on the floor, I uncross my feet, I sit up, I go to one side completely. Off your elbow, I know that sometimes you may be tempted to stay on your elbow because it's more comfortable, but trust me, you'll have more, the higher you are on this move here, the easier it's going to be. You can either trap here or you just hook it completely. Your opposite leg on the floor and hip bump your hips and boom, easily take them over. Okay, I'll do it one more time. So he sits back, I uncross my feet, I hook, foot here, I lift my hips up and then roll them completely over to the mouth. Next move. We go for the Kimura. Secure the grip, I reach over, I grab my wrist, make sure the arm is bent like a chicken wing, hook the inside of the foot here, and now your hip out at least twice. One, two, cross your feet over, and then slowly take this towards his head. Make sure the arm stays bent. If it puts it straight, we can work with it, and we can start switching it up here. I can start exposing his back, but ideally you wanna keep his elbow bent. Next move here. I try to go for the hip bump, but he locks his arms around me. So as I go forward to hit, see he locks his hands here. You don't want him to flatten you out here. So what you do with your feet here, you move your hips back, encircle the neck, reach through here, grab your, your wrist, okay? I can scoot forward and I get heavy on this side here, and I can apply a little pressure there and catch him in the guillotine from here. And in the final one, from this position here, I'm going to do my hip bump in that direction again. But this time I'm going over his head. I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna hug, and I'm gonna bump really high in that direction. He's gonna to have to post his arm there. That allows my left leg to become very light, and boom, I immediately lock my foot over here. Now, I'm not immediately going into a triangle, instead, I like this move here because he's completely trapped here. If he does nothing here, I could just bring my elbow here and I'll start doing an elbow press on this arm here. If he bends it back, if he bends his arm back, I can control the elbow and I slide my fingers here and, and I can do an, almost like a kimura, elbow press here as well. Not to mention that I can also put my foot on the hips I can angle myself, I can go for the triangle, I can go for the, uh, for the arm bar. From this triangle, I can also extend this arm here, elbow press here, there's nothing but eye candy here. And then you can also do a nasty wrist lock from here. So as you can see, there's several moves that you can do right from the closed guard. I hope you guys enjoyed it, practice. Have any questions, put them out there. I'll see you on the next one, Trillo Nation. We are out.